Hello, once again, YouTube. White D five eight six here. Um, tonight, this is my second video beside that base test video I did. Um, tonight, this is going to be a video on my iPhone SE, um, the battery health on it. So if you got a, if you're running iOS eleven point three or later, you'll be able to check your like battery health on your phone. So I'm going to show you this now. So once you're on your home screen, like I am, you're going to want to go into your settings. And then once you're in your settings, go to where it says battery. And then it'll say battery health beta right there. If you didn't know this right here, this tells you everything that's been using all your battery the most. As you can see, mostly YouTube and music, mine, messages, and phone and FaceTime. So, um, yeah, go in here. I've had, my, I've had this phone since August of 2017. And... Right here, it tells me my maximum capacity, 90%, which I don't see how because I've only had the phone since last August. I got it brand new. It wasn't used. It was new. So, um, yeah, this is in beta still, so this might not be accurate. So, all right, you see right here where it says peak performance capacity compatibility, or I think that's how you say it. But, um, anyway, it says right here. This iPhone has experienced an unexpected shutdown because the battery was unable to deliver the necessary peak power. Performance management has been applied to help prevent this from happening again, which I don't see how because this phone is still relatively new. It's a 2016 phone, but seriously, like, I was at the beach about a month and a half ago, maybe two months now. Um, I was there and I was on the beach, had 22%, and then my phone all of a sudden just shut off. I don't know why, and then this came on and after I updated it, because I updated it when I was there. And, uh, anyway, I don't know why it done this, and so, if you're on iOS 11.3 or later, you'll be able to see this. If you're not on iOS 11.3 or later, I suggest that you update so you can check this. But, if you're, if you're somebody that don't know how to update their phone, first, I'm going to start at the home screen, so, you, so I can show you how to get to this. You go into your settings, go down to where it says general, then go to software update. Then it'll check for the update, which mine's up to date because I update mine regularly. But um, yeah, if it's not there, if there's not an update there, restart your phone. So, so yeah, that's it. 